Hey, YouTubers. So I'm in the garage again. Yes, the garage on this uh, Sunday afternoon. So uh, anyway, um, today is New Year's Eve of 2023. Pretty damn amazing as hell. Yeah, damn amazing as holy hell. Anyway, I'm smoking a big ass pipe right now, like a big ass cigar. Anyway, uh, big ass pipe right now, like a big ass cigar. Subtle of heavy English. Here we go. Oh, ah, shit. Uh, this is happens when tobacco is a little bit too wet. Uh, not wet as in a pussy, you know, but you know, a little bit too wet in general. Whew. One sec. Sorry, I just spit. I just spit. Damn. Use the lighter as a tamper just because, or not the lighter, the uh, tamper because I don't want the lighter to get too hot uh, because it's plastic. So, uh, yeah, I don't want to burn myself. There we go. Ah. So, Happy New Year's Eve. Yep, Happy New Year's Eve 2023. So, as you can clearly see, I'm at my parents' house right now. Nice big-ass parents like a big-ass cigar. I will be staying up till midnight to see the ball drop. You know, the big ass ball, like the big ass cigar. When I say a ball, I don't mean a testicle. I mean uh, the ball drop in, in, you know, Times Square or that kind of crap. Anyway, so I worked today. I worked um, today from uh, 9.30 to 1.30, which was a four hour shift. So they were quiet in the beginning and then uh, busy at the end. Um, I was doing carriages, you know, big ass carts like the big ass cigar, not big ass farts, uh, being silly ass like the big ass cigar. Uh, somebody asked me on my channel, I'm not gonna say who, who said this out of, you know, privacy, whatever, but, uh, somebody asked me on my channel, am I still happy doing what I'm doing right now, which is carts at Roche Brothers? And the answer is yes. So, you know, somebody suggested, you know, I could do something different for a job or, for example, I could get more hours like, you know, I could work, you know, more traditional job, you know, 40 hours a week or 30 hours a week or 25 hours a week. And I'm actually happy what I'm doing right now with the hours I'm doing right now. And yes, you're free to call me a lazy bum, whatever. So... Um, yeah, enough, enough talk about that kind of crap. So, uh, yeah, the work was uh, pretty busy today. And then, uh, what else? Uh, my parents and I, uh, my parents picked me up from work, and we found out the pizza place downtown was actually closed today. They're actually closed on Sundays, which kind of sucks, you know, kind of sucks, you know. So it sucks that the pizza place was closed. So instead, my dad's like, you know, do you want a burger from um, this uh, local place downtown? I'm not gonna say the place name because I don't wanna dox myself, you fucking dox myself. So he's like, do you want a, you know, a burger from this place? I'm like, yeah, sure. It's like, you know, that's fine. The burger and fries are fine. And uh, they have gluten-free buns. So my dad orders the burger, a big ass burger, like the big ass cigar and big ass French fries. And then uh, my parents and I drive to uh, this uh, Chinese place, this Chinese place, not gonna mention the name, I don't want, you know, dox myself. Um, 
and basically we got uh, Chinese food and basically uh, while my parents are in the Chinese food place I go across to the tip glass liquor store yeah the tip glass liquor store and um, because the Chinese place is actually right near the tip glass liquor store Ew, got, got food in my mouth. Sorry, sorry about that. One sec. Sorry, this bit. I had, I, I was just eating bread. I had a little seed in my mouth. Sorry about that. I know that's gross. So, uh, mm. so I was at the Tip Glass Liquor Store, and I got. Uh, uh, two lottery tickets, two lotto tickets, uh, scratch off cards. Uh, unfortunately, both of them were losers. Uh, two uh, one dollar tickets. So I spent two dollars on lottery tickets. Uh, you know what? It's just for fun. Honestly, people say don't get go, don't get started. You know, it's a big, it's a bad habit. You know, uh, honestly, I spend per week five bucks. It's like you know, uh, honestly, people spend five bucks on a fucking sandwich. It's like you know. Uh, I know people say they're very addictive, you know, the scratch tickets, the scratch off cards. But you know what? I'm not going to get addicted. I can tell you right now, I'm not addicted. Uh, you know, knock on wood, whatever. So, uh, not wood is in your pecker, you know, but wood is in whatever. So, uh, then my parents and I went to the um, burger place and we picked up my burger. It was not bad for, for the price. For the uh, we paid for the gluten free bond, which they charge you extra for a gluten free bond. They also charge you for the tip. Obviously, you're supposed to leave a tip. Obviously, out of courtesy. Um, they also charge you for the cheese. They also charge you for the bacon. We got bacon on my burger, and I think it was like twenty bucks. But I mean. They give you a healthy, they give you a family, like a, they give you a lot of French fries, a lot of French fries. They're not cheap. And they also give you um, a nice big burger. It's a nice big burger. It's not like a little burger. And then uh, we went home and I took off my, um, my work clothes, I took a shower because I was all sweaty. And yes, I take a shower after work, not before work. I know people, I know the dickhead trolls will say, ew, you don't shower before work. That's so fucking nasty, dude. That's so fucking nasty. You smell when you go to work. Well, you know what, dude? I, I get all sweaty at work. It makes more sense to take a shower after work. It makes a lot more sense. To take a shower after work as opposed to before work so i took a shower after work and um you know kind of uh you know washed off a lot of the sweat off my body anyway anyway have a nice day pretty fucking cool bye